The brand new Sonic Unleashed PC port pretty much came out of nowhere. And yes, it is really, really good and gives you all the modern conveniences you would expect from a PC port. This has been made from the Xbox 360 version and is what is known as a static recompilation. But I'm not here to waffle on about this. I'm here to show you how to get this set up as quickly and easily as possible. So let's just get into it. So you want to grab the Unleashed Recomp project from the official GitHub and I'll put a link for this in the description below. Just make sure you grab it from the releases on the right hand side. There's a Flatpak version for Linux and there's a Windows version for Windows. And of course, most of us are going to be using Windows. For all of the other files that you need, this is what you want. And for the game itself, you can use ISO format. But if you've got all of your game files inside of a folder, like you may be using for Xenia, you can use that instead. The title update 2 is just a singular update file. And finally, we've got the somewhat optional DLC. The DLC also contained a bunch of HD lighting stuff. And rather than include that with the normal update, they hid it behind the DLC. Bit of a shifty move if you ask me. So if you don't have this, you are missing out on better visuals. If these files are in individual folders for you, you wanna do what I've done here and take them out. So you should have the game files and the recon project from the GitHub page. And you wanna make sure that you unzip this like I've already done here. Then just open up this folder and boot up the EXE. You want to select your language here and then press next. Press next again and this is where we're adding the game ISO or the game folder along with that update file. So if you're using an ISO version you want to hit add files. Press next to this, find your Sonic Unleashed game files, select the ISO and then just press open. If you're not using an ISO and all of your files are inside of a folder you want to use this add folder button instead. Find the root of the game and hit open like I've just shown you and with any luck this green light next to game here should light up. Now we need to add the update file. So hit add files again, find the title update 2 file, select it and hit open. Now we can hit next and move on to the DLC. And if you're not using the DLC, you can completely ignore this. Now in any case, I would recommend just hit add files. Then go into the Sonic files, find the DLC and select all of them. And as I mentioned earlier, if these are in individual folders, go ahead and take them out. Then select them all and then hit open. Now we can hit next and then press next again to get everything installed. If everything has installed correctly, you should get this screen. And this is where you give thanks to those names that you see scrolling by right now. And after you've done that, you can press next to boot up the game. Now you definitely need to take a look at the video options as there's a bunch of stuff you can do to make the image look better and customize. So for sure, take a look in here and see if there's anything that you wanna change. There we go, that's how to get the new Sonic Unleashed PC port set up as quickly and easily as possible. And if you like these kind of quick and to the point guides, slam me a subscribe and check out the channel. And if you found this video helpful, slam me a thumbs up. And apart from that, go play some games. Adios.